Hey everybody and welcome back to part two of Bioshock with me, Joe from the Bitpack. Where we last left off we had just run through that uh, nice tunnel back there that we can no longer get into, thank the lord. As it was flooding and we're now in here with maybe a companion. Maybe not over here. Uh, I saw that. Give him the combo. Zap him, then whack him. One two punch. Remember, the one two punch. Yeah, this. Where the heck are you? Oh, there you are. Oh, great. Our aim is spot on. even pressing it whenever I'm using the thing. Now where were we? We don't smoke. Uh, that was just a joke on the plane. I like to fill, film noir. We don't drink. Granted, it does take away our... It takes away your Eve when you drink, but gives you health. And it takes away your health when you smoke, but gives you Eve. So... Tell, tell Ryan I'm sorry. Oh, I won't do it again. No, please, please, don't do that. The whole thing will go. No! There's one dead yeah. puppy. Record me. And he's not. Come on! I just want to talk to you. This place is uh, a little bit messed up. I can't jump over the yeah, that's right. Okay, well I guess we know which elevator we're getting in. The slow one. Listen, I've got a family. I need to get them out of here. But the splicers have cut me off from them. If you can reach them in Neptune's bounty, then maybe, just maybe, I know you must feel like the unluckiest man in the world right now, but you're the only hope I'll ever see my wife and child again. Go to Neptune's bounty. Find my family, please. I, uh... I'll do it. I can fight for a man that uh, loves his family. Can I, what? Can I get to you down there? This is happening before at none. Why aren't you here? Why is it today and not then when you were warm and sweet? Why can't mommy hold you to her breast and feel your teeth? Oh, no. No, no, no. No! Oh. Oh. Plasmids changed everything. They destroyed our bodies, baby. our minds. We couldn't handle it. Best friends butchering one another. Babies strangled in cribs. The whole city went to hell. Okay, we can 
only carry nine first aid kits. Seems like a lot, I know. Probably gonna go through them moderately quickly. There's a lot of Merlot in here, but we're looking for dollar dollar bills. And the blood, apparently. Oh. If you spot a splicer in the water, hit him with the electro bolt. Just in the tub. As much as I would like to drink to my heart's content. Water still. Money. We have our first audio diary of many. Another New Year's, another night alone. I'm out and you're stuck in Festus. Working. Huh. Imagine my surprise. But I guess I'll have another drink. <laughs> Here's a toast to Diane McClintock. Silliest girl in Rapture. Silly enough to fall in love with Andrew Ryan. <laughs> Silly enough. Hear that on New Year's Eve there was some sort of uh, attack on this particular. Okay, that's great. You want to not do that and it's warn you that we're walking up the stairs? Oh! I'll touch me. I didn't take anybody's little ones. Hey, hey, hey! I'm gonna get a different controller. This is ridiculous. Oh! Hey! quite come out, but, uh, I think you guys saw that. wonder what that was. And I wonder what that is. Um, is it in here? I'm too spliced up. I'm too spliced up. Nobody's gonna want me. I'm seeing ghosts. Another audio light. Tell me why you've had a hole in the wall the size of Plymouth Rock coming out of your crapper going on three weeks now? Now, I ain't saying I'm Shakespeare. I'm trying to run a respectable theater. I got working folk coming in from Port Neptune trying to catch a little diversion. And all I can think about is the stink coming out of your shitter. Get it fixed. Oh, well, yeah, I can agree that you really don't want a hole in the bathroom coming into a theater. But at this point, it's us. Would you kindly lower that weapon for a minute? You think that's a child down there? Don't be fooled. She's a little sister now. Somebody went and turned a sweet baby girl into a monster. Whatever you thought about right and wrong on the surface, well, that don't count for much down in Rapture. Those little sisters, they carry Adam. The genetic material that keeps the wheels of rapture turning. Everybody wants us, everybody needs us. Mm. I have a little sister, and she may be a monster, but I don't know if she's that bad. I don't know if she's, you know, not human. Um. Hey now. Oh. I remember you. Hey, 
day. First good look there at our main source of competition here, the big daddies. I don't think these level splices are going to cause us too much of a problem, but uh, I don't very much relish having to fight a big daddy, but I don't also think we uh, can't avoid it. <laughs> Who is it? Uncivil, uncouth, uncultivated! <laughs> I don't very much appreciate you insulting me that way. Neptune's bounty. Let's just make sure there's nothing left in this area. This is first aid kit. Okay, we don't need that apparently. Lots of sinks. Let's do some bandages. We don't need those either right now, really. And that's closed off, so I guess it's the only way to go. Nope. I didn't need to. Uh, uh, oh, yes, run, you coward. Where'd she go? Bodies. Yeah. It's a high stakes town, you gotta get money where you can. Like, uh, got that other first aid kit. Okay, where are we going now since we've gotten shut out over there? Through here? Okay. Ooh.
I pop with my knuckles. Nah, try to aim for the head. You do more damage if you actually hit the target, though. Now you've met Andrew Ryan, the bloody king of Rapture. Now find your way to emergency access. Okay, we're in a new area. We're in the medical pavilion. And we have an emission. So... I think I'm going to call it there for this episode. As always, you know, like and comment if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel if you want to see more videos like it. See ya.